it's time for dentists to think long-term about their marketing. The next big thing is on the horizon is the rise of the Internet of Things, or IoT. I'll be back right after the break to tell what IoT is and why you need to be prepared to use it to attract more and better dental patients in your future. Thanks for joining me on this edition of the Patient Attraction Podcast. I'm Colin Receiver. Now let's go way back. And when the internet first came into widespread use, the only way to access it was on a desktop computer. Now, laptops weren't widely used and tablets, notebooks, and smartphones hadn't been invented yet. Now, as the internet went mobile, marketing had to adjust so their content would also load very quickly, display properly, and of course, hold that viewer's attention onto smaller screens. People now access the internet over smartwatches, TV screens, and a host of other devices. Even some everyday devices in the home are connected, like your thermostats and your alarm systems and even TVs these days. The connectivity trend is creating the internet of things, and it's going to force you to reevaluate how you market online. One recent prediction is that search will become more responsive to queries without needing to display search engine results pages. Now, we already have an example of that with Google's answer box. Someone looking for the cooking time for chicken doesn't need a website, just the right answer. That means that your website may soon become obsolete. But the IoT offers many opportunities as well. Imagine being able to send an appointment reminder to your patient's refrigerator as well as their smartphone. The Internet of Things is going to take time to develop and catch on, but don't be caught unprepared. Stay abreast of the trends and be ready to shift your marketing as everything you know about the Internet evolves. Dr. Lawrence Fox from Virginia decided to leave the staying current on the Internet to Smartbox. He said this, quote, I'm not all that savvy on the Internet with marketing and things like that. I just know that's not my thing. I liked what Colin had to say, and when we got in touch with him, we felt like we needed to make the change, so we left our other marketing dude, and we turned to you guys, and we're happy we did, end quote. Keep watching the Patient Attraction Podcast, and I'll tell you how the Internet of Things is progressing. Until then, keep moving forward. Music